Senator Wendy Davis emerges from the Texas State Senate greeted by a cheering crowd. Today was democracy in action. Davis's 11-hour filibuster helped run out the clock, blocking a contentious anti-abortion bill, largely supported by Republicans. My back hurts, <laughs> and I don't have a whole lot of words left in my vocabulary after all that talking, but I am overwhelmed. Texas State Senate rules wouldn't allow Davis to sit down, so her chair was removed when she began her marathon speech. Eleven hours into it, Republicans complained she had strayed off topic and cut her off. That's when fellow Democrats jumped in, backed by hundreds of protesters to drown out the voting. Officers had to physically remove some of the spectators. They may be able to act like they can't hear us when we're calling them out on what they're doing, but let me tell you, Tonight, they heard your voices. The Republican bill would have shut down 37 out of the state's 42 abortion clinics. You missed a hell of a show. (laughs) (laughs) Yet when the clock passed midnight, the anti-abortion bill died without being properly signed. Probably the worst night that I've experienced since I've been in the Senate. The celebration by crowds of orange-clad abortion rights activists went on into the early morning hours. A dramatic finish to a debate that may not be over. Republicans are hinting that another special session could still be called to pass the bill. Nia Hawkins, Associated Press.